predefined networking is basically a new way to operate the network, basically by integrating open interfaces between a centralized network management system and the network element, thus pulling the control of the network elements out of the network elements themselves into a centralized uh, software device. This kind of pulling together concepts which are already existing uh, from control plane um, uh, concepts like GMPLS, where there's the centralized PCE, the pass computation element. And uh, the, the key thing is that it opens up the control of the network and allows new, um, new applications like network virtualization. And, it, and with this, it, it can integrate the network control into the control, for example, of a cloud computing environment and data centers. The key thing is that it's a simple, lightweight application programming interface between some kind of central control element and the network element themselves. This means the control is not contained in the network element, but it can be um, controlled by the outside. Openflow has to develop and to mature. Currently there are many research program, uh, projects to, uh, to test out Openflow. There are some issues still with the security, the scalability of Openflow protocol and the applications to carry great networks. It will accelerate the uh, development of new applications so once the, this open interface is in place and you have a virtualization layer, then you can assign slices of the network to individual external parties, some service providers, and they can develop their own applications to run, to control, to, to modify the network. And this will speed up innovation in the networking area, just like it, it happened in the cloud computing arena. And the same will be available also in the networking. Routers and switches will, will become also a central part in the, for example, in the control of, of cloud computing environments, cloud networking environments. So uh, in addition to, um, to create a virtual machine on a high performance computing environment somewhere, you can also at the same time reserve networking resources to do high speed uh, data transfer and uh, thus the, the network is, becomes an integral part, for example, in a cloud computing environment. I think SDN will certainly modify the way uh, te telecom and carrier network is operated. It will open up the network by um, in installing um, hardware abstraction layer by enabling new services like virtualization, like um, this open control of the network. So it is certainly a way to, to change the way the network is operated. ADVA is developing an OpenFlow agent for the ADVA FSP3000 uh, product line, the RODEM. And with this OpenFlow agent integrated in our RODEM, um, we can now test and experiment with the OpenFlow protocol for an optical network. This OpenFlow agent and uh, the ATFA RODEMs are installed at the University of Essex in a testbed in the research project Ophelia. And within this project, um, this testbed, this ring network, is open to any researcher in the world to uh, request and register there and perform some experiments on this uh, network.